Um, we're here to address a serious um, issue arising from the Auditor General um, report stating serious bridges and lack of transparency in the way Amana I vote. Many ministries and prostata have been carrying out their work. Uh, reports from the Auditor General says that 65 federal agencies that has continued to collate um, allocation every year since their establishment they have never submitted audited reports. Report also from the Auditor General says that between the National Assembly and the Presidency, huge billion that are supposed to be remitted to the purpose of government has not also happened. So we felt that there's no way we will continue as a zero as a country to allocate resources to agencies that they don't account to anybody. So they collect this money and do whatever they want to do, no accountability. This cannot continue to happen, even when the government is not you know, claiming or fighting corruption. This is a bridge of uh, the whole fight against corruption that you collect money and you pocket the money and do not account to anybody. This is unacceptable. So that is why we come here to raise this concern, to advise government to take proactive measures so that you know there will be accountability and transparency in the way in which public resources are spent and managed in this country. This report is coming at a time when the Nigerian government is financially desperate to meet its basic responsibilities. Hence, accumulating foreign debts against expert advice and drastically stifling the mega post of the ordinary Nigerians in the guise of generating revenue to maintain its high cost of governance that has not benefited the country in years. Accountability of public institutions is the least the government can offer its people for their continuous sacrifice and, and torture, despite the prevailing economic situation. This acute waste and irresponsibility cannot be tolerated. If we are to cope wastages in public finance, if we are to enthrone transparency and accountability, and if we are to fight corruption effectively, the way we organize and treat the audit process must change and must be radically transformed. The whole fight against corruption that you collect money and you pocket the money and do not account to anybody, this is unacceptable. So that is why we come here to raise this concern, to advise government to take proactive measures so that you know, there will be accountability and transparency in the way in which public resources are spent and managed in this country.